Hello to all my awesome YouTube fans. How are you doing today? Well, thank you so much for tuning today's awesome vlog. Curious on what I'm doing today. Basically, I'm going to talk to all of you, uh, should I say. I went down to uh, T-Mobile, uh, should I say, and looked at different prices of different phones. Apple is so much more expensive than Android, uh, basically. Here's the thing. This is what I'm kind of stuck on. Should I stay with Apple or should I switch to an Android phone? And here's the thing. I am not paying no $1,600 for a freaking phone. If I was going to stay with a Apple phone, I would go with a different iPhone. But if I was going to completely switch from iPhone to Android, Android would be 10 times cheaper. But my problem is, I don't know how to use an Android phone. The rest of my own family has Android. I'm the only one that has an iPhone. Because here's my iPhone 6S. A lot of you know this phone, because yes, it is an older model, it's four years old. But this phone is still working just fine. But the problem is, what I'm having the issue with this phone is the battery and not holding a very good charge. But it does. And I'll show you what I mean. Okay. You know, I don't know if you can see it or not. The battery needs service. Here's the problem. I'm not trading this phone in. I already paid this phone off. But I'm keeping this phone. Because I have a lot of important information like contacts, photos, of my accounts, and stuff all on this phone. That's what a lot of people don't understand. Yes, you can trade your phone in, but here's the thing. You need to factory reset your phone before you trade in. And if you don't do that, what about the armed people stealing your information on your phone? Because here's the thing. A phone is a device you use to text and call and also look up all sorts of different things on your phone. But talking about more personal information about the phone is all stored on this device. Like when I take pictures or if I add a contact or if I add certain apps on my phone or my emails and stuff like that is on my phone. But the problem is I am very stuck of trying to figure out which phone to go with. Do I finally switch to Android or just stay with Apple completely? I want something that's going to be more easier for me to understand and also use because I have a lot of music on my phone as well but if I completely switch to an Android phone I have to convert all my music from ACC format to M3 format and that's going to be very difficult and complicated for me because that's not very easy that is very difficult but I've been using iTunes for a long time and I also been with Apple for a very long time as well from 2007 If I can calculate the years It's 2019 Take away 2007 I've been with Apple for 12 years Okay, but I only had my phone For only four years but I've been with Apple for 12. But I'm just trying to figure out, do I want to switch from Apple to switch to Android? I just don't know, I'm very stuck of trying to make a choice of what phone to go with. But I'm not paying no $1,600 for a freaking iPhone. That's absolutely ridiculous. Who has $1,600 to buy a Apple iPhone? That's just crazy. But uh, if you guys and girls are supporting the new channel, 
please hit that subscribe button. Leave an awesome comment down below. Please like, please share, peace out. We'll hopefully see you in the future vlog. And have a very nice day. Catch you later.